I invite everybody to come here and um, and test this food. You know, I've been eight months here. I'm fed it by a Moroccan woman, which is my uh, chef de cuisine in the Riyadh case. She looks like, you know, a chef. She's a bit fat. <laughs> and it's a woman. It's very, very important. You know, in Moroccan, women make food, Moroccan food. You'll see some of the chefs, they are men, and they are more, you know, working on this European food. But if you want to eat Moroccan, you got, uh, I found this mama, you know, <laughs> this big woman, and then she fit, it, she fit me now since, you know, eight months, and I'm telling you, I'm very happy of it. <laughs> I can <laughs> very, see very, you're, as you're a French, as well. a French, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, many of them will say, well, we are the best. No, 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 we are not the best. The difference, you know, that's what ma makes the, makes it rich, interesting, you know, different food. And All over the world, you've got very nice food. And your idea is to provide really, really fresh food, organic if possible, to all of your customers, isn't it? Yes, as much as we can. We are not uh, working like a hotel, you know. Hotel, you got this set up. Everything is, you know, in the, in the frozen part or in the fridge, uh, big fridges. We don't work like this. We provide menus and... and, and uh, a la carte, but what we are trying to do is communicate as much as we can with the guests and then try to get the order on the morning. And then it could be only a question like, uh, what do you want to eat today? Yeah. Yeah. And then could be fish, chicken, whatever. And then they let us, let us you know, cook it the way we want it but they got the product that they want at the beginning, and then we cook it minute. We buy it in the morning, and then we cook it at night or for, uh, for lunch. And this is the, the idea, to cook fresh product a la minute. We're doing, you know, uh, we, we have a list, for example, here of uh, all different infusions. Something like 10 different infusions, they're fresh and natural, and we do it minute. It's like fruit as well. I got this um, these very funny uh, things from uh, from all my guests, and sometimes they're telling me, "Well, we've been waiting almost ten minutes, you know, to get a an apple juice, for example, or something like this." And I tell them yes, but if you want to compare it in, uh, with European uh, with uh, Europe, you go somewhere, you ask for your apple juice. You wait maybe sometimes more than 10 minutes, but usually it's quicker. You have it in two or three minutes. He comes, give you the apple juice, not fresh, ask you to pay before drink it. Yeah, it's a bit different. And then the, the guest used to say, well, did he, did he go to get the, the apple outside or on a? Yes, sir, because it's fresh and he's doing it and he's mixing it and he's giving to you. It takes 10 minutes, but you got something fresh and we don't ask you to pay straight away, you know? Because uh, our philosophy is, you know, relax, fresh, natural fresh. Like spa, you were talking about spa. I was managing one of the, big, of the biggest spa in Europe, in Vichy. And then uh, <laughs> there's nothing to see. Uh, for sure, I don't have 35 cabins here. I got one. But it's very, very traditional. I'm trying to... Uh, to uh, to explain to the people that it has nothing to see, you know, with, with Europe. Uh, if you want to, met, to go to the hammam, for example, you go to hammam in France, open the door, you sit in the hammam, steam, then wait to sweat. It's nothing to see here. Nothing to see. Here you just sit, you see a, a woman coming in, and she starts to take you off the skin. I mean, cultural uh, things that you can share with, uh, with your wife or your husband I mean, in couples. They're very nice and very traditional experience, in fact, that I never met anywhere. This is the difference with an hotel and uh, with Marrakesh. Maybe you find it in uh, other places, but, well, I'm just talking about my experience, and that's what makes it very personal, very different than an hotel and than anywhere that I've seen until now, in fact. And your customers? 
Do they really like this? Is yeah, this something that, that they enjoy, that they want to stay longer? Yeah, because it's different, it's personal, and it's fresh, and it's natural, and it's traditional. That's why they came. You see? For example, we are now uh, talking about Riyad Kass, but it's the same in, uh, in Darle Sigon, in fact. And that's why you can't get ev uh, internet everywhere, in any of our uh, properties, in fact. If you need it, you know where you have to go, but, you know, it's just simple things that will make the difference, and I got so many... Uh, compliments, I would say, from women. You know, the book come and tell me at the end of the of the their stay and say and tell me, well, that's very nice. I've, this is the first thing in five, ten years that I didn't see my uh, husband disconnecting and taking a day off. It's huge. It's huge. Yeah. And then we are in the art of uh, what we are trying to do. In fact. This is our philosophy, to get the people relaxed. You know, that's, what is a holiday, in fact? To get relaxed and disconnect. About. And then we are in the heart of, uh, of the things, in fact. We are obviously terribly happy here. Yes, I am very happy because, you know, they are simple things. Natural, fresh, relaxed. What do we need? What do you need when you go to holiday?